Hey, what's up guys? We're back again with another Queen Pop Loon attack. Um showing you this base here. Uh kind of like a four corner type base or anything squared uh, that has these outside set boxes, uh inside set air defenses. Can kind of be a pain. Uh it's not fully maxed out yet. He's got just a very few things to still max out. Both expos set up, uh blower facing out this way. It's got a CC fairly exposed, so kind of easy to pull. I'm going to put a troop over here and pull it. And that means I'm going to blast out that air defense. Um, now, this video, I want to show you tactics on ending on a queen. So this attack, remember, I can only run this attack with my lowest account. It's all I can do. So I got to make every base work for it. Um, and I think I've showed you I've pretty much made every base in the world work for it. This has an offset queen out here so you know you want to kind of keep two air defenses to run over her but the cc is way over here i cannot pull the cc on this side this guy's not using hounds or anything i have to pull those troops so how am i going to accomplish all this uh, i choose to blast out that air defense because it's you know this one still needs maxed out eh, that might help me keeping it so if I blast that out and I set an air troop over here, I can pull the CC. Then I'll bring the CC over here and kill it. Um, that's going to kind of use up my heroes. Now, if the queen's way over here, how do I kill her? Well, I'm going to end on her. And since the blower is facing out this way, I'm going to do a surgical pattern around this entire area. Start over here. Come with the hound. Come with the hound. Throw a bunch of loons. A bunch of loons. Remember... Since the air defenses are set in, even if I put a loon right here, they're going to go this way, which causes more of a problem. That's longer flight, and the air defense is going to pound on it. Sometimes these aren't the best bases to hit with air, but this attack obliterates it. So let's take a look. I'll show you what I mean. I'm coming in with my normal troop set. Uh, I got 25 loons, 4 hounds. Three of my own, one max in there. And I bring the same spells every single time. I do this exact every single time, guys. These are the only troops I really have upgraded at Town Hall 9. Uh, I'm number 23. He's number 9. You can see why this is beneficial to our war clan. So if I blast out that air defense, I'm losing this area. But I figure I'd just bring a minion. You can see he's not even level 2, level 1. But I can set him up inside the radius, and I don't have to spend a lot of troops. If he gets blown up or shot down, that's going to force me to put some loons over here. Not a biggie. And then just the simple lay pattern. So here we go. You can see I start off like I always do. I uh, put that earthquake in an area where I think I'm going to capture the most stuff. I uh, seeing if I could blast out the blower, and I do. I've been using that trick a bit lately. He pulls out a bunch of archers and some wizards. Uh, there are other troops in there. I think he had dragon or some loons or something. Um, that leaves me with a conundrum. Usually I just like using my queen. You can see I'm sitting and thinking, ah, oh, crap, I can't just really use my queen. They'll blast her. She doesn't have enough power, so I guess I'll put my king in, and now I don't really have cleanup troops. Oh, well. Time for the attack. So I come in. I start my troops. I didn't expect that Tesla to start up, but you see I come in with these troops first, and I'm bringing this hound across their face. And then I'm bringing my next hound across their face. I didn't expect that Tesla, so first loons are getting shot. Oh, well. But that's going to collect up some fire. And then I can continue my lay. Collect a couple bombs. And you can see I'm using no spells yet. I know I have to use my spells to get across the base. Man, he's got... This is usually a hound and loon killer. Wiz, double Tesla, super beefy. Oh, well. So I know what they're having to do. I'm only using one spell, and I'm waiting, I'm waiting. And now once they clear out those corners, I'm going to move in. But I still got to get down to that queen. I'm hoping my loons make quick work and keep those hounds alive. I need a bunch of hounds coming over here for this reason. When they start popping, then I throw on my haste to get to that last whiz tower. And here's one mistake. 
So I'm planning that queen to squat, but since I started over here, a bunch of lazy loons made it over to this Tesla, and the queen took a walk and started focusing on them before she could focus in on my hounds. So hounds down, loons are left, and here's the brilliant part of this attack. I hasted across, I got that whiz tower down, ah, uh, boom, the whole time, She's working on that last hound, which allows my loons to play cleanup. And now I got like 30 loons ready to wreck her day. Boom. She gone. So this is an extreme case. A lot. I get a lot of questions. Okay, cast. What do I do? The queen is not in the middle of the air defenses. I don't think I can do it because your plan is to run over the queen, pop those hounds, let the minions do work, let loons go over top of her. Yes, that is a good plan. That is an ideal plan, but life doesn't always work out like you draw it up. Not every base is the same. So what do you do when she's not by the air defenses? You end on her. End your troops where the queen's at. Let them finish the dirty work. If you can use your heroes, um, you know, if this was a hound in the CC and I could clear out, you know, these corners and end over on her, I'm throwing my heroes down so everything is ending on her. And that's ideal. I do that a lot on it. those anti-three-star, even anti-two-star spread bases where you have to travel all the way and get where she is, not even by any air defense. And that's my suggestion to you. That's my plans always. So go ahead and give it a try. It works. I showed you those bows were set up. You had to pull the CC. Um, you know, mix of max Town Hall 9s and non-Town Hall 9 max. But it worked. It did the job. So I hope you like it and understand. Uh, go ahead and press like and subscribe. Check me out on Camcord, guys. It's blowing up these days. Uh, hit me up. Follow me on Twitter. I always post when I'm streaming or I try to. Um, and I'll try to hit on there more. And I'll see you guys next time.